Hey everyone, it's Audrey with Simplifying Tech for Seniors. And in today's video tutorial, what I wanna do is I wanna show you how you can make your iPad just a little bit more personal by changing out the wallpaper. It's gonna be super simple and easy to do, and I'm gonna take you step by step showing you how to do it. But stay tuned until the end because I've got a special treat where I'm going to show you where every single time that you open your iPad, you'll be able to have a different photo that unlocks memories galore. So be sure to watch until the end. All right, let's jump right in so I can show you how to get that wallpaper changed. In order to change out your wallpaper photos, you'll need to go to your settings. So you're looking for this little cogwheel app icon. So tap on that. And over on the left, you're going to scroll down until you see wallpaper. Tap on wallpaper. Now over here to the right, it's showing you what you wallpaper you have currently set up for your lock screen as well as your home screen. What we're going to do is we're going to add a new wallpaper. Tap on that. And now you, as you scroll through this, you can choose any one of these uh, wallpapers that Apple gives you. But up here at the top, you have the ability to choose between your photos or people, a photo shuffle. Then you can go through all of these other ones. But what we're going to do is we're just going to add a photo. So tap there. Now you may or may not have these options at the top. I know my brother doesn't have it, um, so I'm not sure why not, uh, but you should have it over on the left-hand side and you can choose from memories and favorites, photos. Um, but for right now, I'm just going to choose this photo right here. This is a beautiful sunset picture that I took at the beach up in Destin, okay? And now, once I have that on my screen, I want to show you that what you can do with this photo is you can actually pinch it to crop it. So let's say maybe this photo came in very large like that. What you can do is just take your pointer and your thumb on the screen and just pinch it to where now it all fits inside of this screen. Now, if you want to zoom in on something, you would just take your pointer and your thumb also, you're gonna set it on the screen and then you're gonna pinch out, okay? And now to move it, you're gonna keep your fingers on the screen and move that image to where you want it on the screen. The other thing that you can do with this is you can actually put like a color filter on your photo just by simply swiping to the right. So there's a black and white, a duo tone, there's a color wash. And then down here, uh, right here, you can actually change the color of it. And also, if you wanted to quickly get back to your photos, you could simply tap on that and choose another photo as well. But we're going to stick with this sunset. And I'm just going to go back. I'm going to slide back over to the natural. Okay. Now, when you're satisfied with that, what you're going to do is you're going to tap on add. And now what it's asking you is, do you want this image as your uh, lock screen? And your lock screen is just simply whenever you uh, pick up your iPhone or your iPad and it just kind of awakens your, your you know, device. Um, and then the home screen, that's when you've unlocked your iPad and it has all the apps and widgets and everything. If you want it to be a wall, a wallpaper pair and have the same image, then you would choose this. But what we're going to do is we're going to customize our home screen as well, because I want my lock screen at the beach and then one at the mountains. So then you would just choose photo. And now it's going to bring me back to my photos and I'm going to choose the mountains for my home screen wallpaper. And same exact thing if I want to put a, um, a filter over it, I can do so when I am happy with that. And when you're happy with yours, you're going to tap on done and then you're going to tap on done again up in that top right. And now let me show you when I put my iPad to sleep and I awaken it, woo, there's the beach. Now let's say I want to go home and I'm going to log into my iPad. 
And now you can see that the mountain photo is my home screen photo, which remains as I go through all of my apps. Okay, now for the fun part that I found a couple months ago and I am absolutely loving. You know those photo frames where you could send photos to her or you uh, preload the photos and that it shuffles through the images? Well, guess what? You get to do that with your iPad. Of course, you do need the iOS 17 and above. So if you do not have the iOS 17, then you're not going to be able to do this. But if you do have the iOS 17, then you get to put that shuffle on and let the memories come rushing back in. So let me show you how to do that. So we're going to go back to our settings and on the wallpaper. And over here, if I scroll over to the left, you notice that I have a different wallpaper sets. So this is one wallpaper set. If I scroll, this is my new wallpaper set. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to add a new wallpaper set. And this is really cool because you can actually set wallpaper pairs for even different holidays. So if you wanted to, you could set your lock screen and your home screen to Christmas themes or Thanksgiving themes. So that's pretty cool. But what we're going to do is we're going to set ours to the photo shuffle. So we're going to tap on photo shuffle. And right here you have the option to let it shuffle through all of your images with people and nature. Or you can choose an album and just tap on favorites and then you can go through all of your albums there. We're going to cancel that. Um, you can also do the shuffle frequency. When, so when you tap on this, you can choose daily. It will change that picture out daily, hourly, or on lock. And what we're going to do is we're going to do the on lock so that I can show you what that looks like, okay? And then you can also select photos manually. So you can click on that and go through all of the images that you want to cycle through. Now, you do only have 50 that you can do right now as of this recording. So you can just choose those 50. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to choose people and nature, and I'm going to choose the people that I want to cycle through. So let me just choose my grandchildren, my children, my husband, and my dad. All right, I've got them selected, and I'm going to tap on done. Now I've got 11 people that it's going to shuffle through, and I'm going to tap on use featured photos. And now it's just showing me right now, if I wanted to, I could just tap on the image and it's gonna show me what it's gonna start cycling through. Once again, you can swipe over and put that filter on it, but I don't want to. I'm good with this, and I'm just gonna tap on Add, and it's gonna ask me again, do I want to keep this as a wallpaper pair and have it the exact same? And I don't, I want to have a different home screen. So I'm gonna customize home screen, and I'm gonna choose a photo, I'm just going to choose this photo of the beach as my home screen and I'm going to tap on done and done again. And now this is my current home screen, but I want to show you this because now when I put my iPad to sleep, every single time that I come to my iPad and I uh, go to unlock it, I get a new memory that is unlocked every single time. And when I tell you that this has brought me so much joy, it is an understatement. The memories that are unlocked is just priceless. And there you have it. That is how you're going to change out to your wallpaper on your lock screen and your home screen. And let me know in the comments below, if you do have the iOS 17, did you choose to do the shuffle? because that is what my phone is set to and my iPad is set to, is the shuffle of all of those photos. If you got anything out of this video at all, give it a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button along with the bell button so you're notified every single time that I put up one of these video tutorials. Until next video, y'all be blessed.
Bye.